Hey everyone, this is Lucky7DX. Welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Trading Card Game. The last episode, we've beat Courtney, we've beaten J uh, we've beaten Steve, now it's time to beat Jack and then Rod. We're halfway there. It's time to take down the letter legendary Ice Grandmaster Jack. I will quickly show off the deck I use once again. I did fix this. I actually started an episode and I'm like, oh my god, I have fucking energies instead of psychic energies. I'm such an idiot. And you guys probably point out, well, hopefully I put an annotation on that just to say to not point that out because I did fix this and everything's good to go now. Um, so the decks are all fixed. Um, Pikachu, Raichu, um, using the promo Pikachus this time, which is going to be kind of interesting. It's going to be an interesting alternative. Um, actually, because I'm using the promo Pikachus, I'm going to skew the energies just a little bit into, like this, because that's going to probably be a little bit better. Um, then Alakazam, uh, Hypno, and Mew. You know, just the basic Psychic like, deck I've been using this whole time. I mean, honestly, it's just not really worth it to use, like, Slowbro or anything like that, because they're just vastly inferior Pokemon. There's really nothing else in the Psychic side to really use, so... Um, I, I guess I could use Gengar, but I want to go for the pure power of, of the Abra line, because they tend to be more powerful and tend to be better Pokemon to use in these sorts of situations. Especially because Jack, if you let him set up, he is terrifying, so... We're gonna go ahead and fight him now. So we had Epic Hotness in the first match, Epic Beard in the second match, and now we've upgraded to Epic Monocle. That's even more terrifying. Like, you're fighting a guy with a monocle, the legendary gentleman Jack Frost, with his deck. Oh, I don't know if it's Jack Frost, but he's Jack, the gentleman. And he is not an easy opponent, so I'm gonna have to be really careful. I got Pikachu, Magnemite, and Abra. I'm gonna go with Magnemite first here and use the Paralysis to hopefully hax on him while I set up other Pokemon. Although if I get a Magneton, that'll also be really good. Um, you do get to go first, that's good. Uh, oh, a Chansey! Yuck! Yuck! Why would I fight a Chansey? Okay, I got a Magnemite and I got the Raichu. Oh, Raichu, you're always here for me. I love it. Um, there's really very little reason for me to be damaging this Chansey, because honestly, it's like... This thing is going to wall forever. He's going to stall a very long time, which is bad, because he's going to get all set up, and I'm going to really have to rely on this Raichu right now. Um, he has a chance, he's a, he still uses Seal Dugong, and then he uses Lapras. We've already seen how potent Dugong can be, so if he gets that thing set up, it's going to be really scary. His Articuno maybe is not really the best legendary, but um, it's still pretty scary, so I do want to watch out for that as well. Um, I'm going to go for this Raichu, though, because that is my best bet. Um, if by some miracle I can kill off this Chansey, I can use Self-Destruct as well and kill off something. However, the odds of him being able to revenge kill is just pretty darn high. Unless he sends out his Lapras, then maybe I can actually do that. Um, Super Energy Retrieval, that'd be pretty handy to have. Uh, I'm gonna attach a Psychic Energy to Pikachu. I do want another Lightning Energy before I go to Raichu, just so I can hopefully get the Thunder going as well, because Thunder will be able to wreck through his team pretty fast. Um, and of course, Agility is for stalling. We've seen how well that's done in the past as well, so... Ugh, starting off with a Chansey. That sucks too, because my uh, Psychic Pokemon aren't going to be able to do anything against that. Raichu is pretty much set up here. I can always use a Super Energy Retrieval for the Psychic, so that's good. Um, I really needed that Raichu going early on in the game. That is going to be very helpful to give me some momentum once Chansey goes down. Eventually, I mean, it eventually, eventually goes down. It's going to be a very long time, apparently. Uh, I'm not sure which Psychic Pokemon is set up yet, so I'm not going to. I'm just going to go ahead and save those energies for now. He's not even attempting to set up this Chansey. I mean, why would you? He's just here to be a wall. He does have the highest HP of any Pokemon in this game at the moment, which is nice. He hasn't evolved anything yet. Oh! Got okay, ourselves so a Magneton! That might be useful to have, so I'm going to go ahead and set for that as well. Um, I do need another Lightning Energy, though, unfortunately. Kind of wasted them all on Raichu, so I have Raichu kind of... I just need two Lightning Energies at the moment. It's a good thing I added in an extra Lightning Energy there, because now it's suddenly like shown to be really useful at the moment. Come on, Lightning Energy. Or we can get a Kadabra. That is also a very good option. So that's going to give me quite a few options. Um, right now, it's going to be basically, you know, me stalling him out and trying to basically... Well, we're both just stalling him right now. This is like a, gi a giant sub-period. You know, me and the gentleman, we're just... It's a gentleman's match. You get a little bit of time to set up, and then everything just goes to town. Mewtwo is also going to be very handy later on. Um, once a lot of these Pokemon who already have Psychic Energies attached to them are down. I mean, obviously, I can just, um, if I get a psychic energy, just the energy from Magnemite alone will be able to charge up the Mewtwo, and that's going to be good. Um, and as long as his Chansey's out of the way, I won't have the resistance to worry about. So, come on, lightning energy, really handy right now. Two lightning energies, perfect. Another Raichu, you know, not bad. But, um, does the Magneton need, oh, I can I should also go for the self-destruct. Um, although, odds are he'll probably be able to revenge kill me, but we'll see. Um, gonna stick with this process now a little bit, because... Now I'm in a good enough shape where I really don't need to worry about... Oh, he's going to switch out. Why are you going to switch that out now? That's a pussy move. Alright, well this could be annoying now because... 
Uh, if I get the confusion, that's gonna suck. Um, now I'm kind of a little worried. Come on, don't hit myself. Shoot! Shoot, shoot, shoot. He can actually kill me now if, if he gets another water energy on this Lapras. That's gonna be really bad. Okay, no, he's not gonna do that. I'm gonna get one more chance to do this here. Come on. I need a miracle on Elm Street. Um, Raichu will build a revenge kill. Worst comes to worst, though. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this Abra on the bench. I'm going to... Uh, I should probably maybe throw that down this cadaver, but I'm not. But please, Thunderway, give me... Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, why can't we have nice things? All right, well, that thing's going to die to confusion. That's going to suck, because now he's going to get a definite advantage by not me not being able to do anything with that Magneton, which just sucks. But I'm going to set this Abra. He's probably, he might be able to kill off his Lapras right now. Uh, or he's going to get the Dugong. That's not good. Um, okay, didn't get the confusion out. That's good. I did this so, so I can use his uh, lower tree cost to just be able to hopefully switch out and... Um, be able to do some good things, but what I'm actually going to do, uh, I don't want to take so much damage from this, you know, I know, I can't risk it, uh, as much as I don't want to get confusion on this thing, right now I need to go ahead, well, I should probably use this, um, I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to use this super energy retrieval, uh, even though I can't get all the energies back yet, I do want this cadaver to be set up, so we're going to get that set up, I'm going to gust a wind out, uh, into this dugong, because I do not want this thing to live, um, it can do 50 damage. I want it just to be dead right now. So, yeah, that's exactly why I was worried that Thunder would actually um, do... If I got the tails on that, the uh, Dugong would have been able to come in and kill this thing. And then I wouldn't have had anything really good to kill it with. So, it's a good thing I did that. Um, that's going to give me a nice, decent advantage here. Oh, there's his first Articuno. So, that's going to be hard. It's, if I get this Confuse Ray, it's going to suck. Come on, no Confusion. Ah! That's going to really cripple, cripple Raichu now. Now, I need that's a 50-50% chance if I can kill this Lapras. Oh, uh, I do not like this. I need a switch. I need a switch. Okay, just a lot of energies, which at this point aren't exactly the most helpful thing either. Um, well, I have Mewtwo. I have Kadabra. I can still pull this off. I get the tails, but it would be really nice to get the heads. Come on, game. Can we have nice things? Why can't we have nice things? Uh, never, never, never. Just never can get anything going my way. He's going to start getting energies. He's going to start trying to get that Articuno, and that thing is going to be bad once it comes out, so... Now I'm not necessarily such a happy camper, but Dabra is going to come out here and hopefully do a lot of damage. I really need something right now. Mewtwo, I'm going to start saying Mewtwo. Um, Super Psy will kill this thing in two hurt turns. However, if he gets the confusion out on me, it's going to then be bad, because then I might kill myself, and the confusion on a Psyche Pokemon is even worse. So, come on! Why can't we have nice things? Game? Come on. Give me a switch. A Pokeball, Alakazam. Alakazam can save my ass. Alakazam can save my ass. Come on. We can't have nice things. We just we just can't have nice things. <sighs> Alright, come on. Do not get the tails right now. And this thing's gonna fall to that. So, this is just bad. This Lapras is just confusing me to death here, and that's just really, really unfortunate. But luckily, this Mewtwo's gonna come in and finish that thing off, so that's good. Um, and then, hopefully I can come up with something... Uh, I really don't know what I can do right now. This is a really tricky situation. I really gonna need my prizes to hopefully give me something else here, because Mewtwo is not gonna be able to hold a fort by himself. I'm gonna get myself another lightning energy, that's not gonna help. Um, Articuno will die in two hits, but it will kill my Mewtwo before that happens. So, Blizzard, uh, heads is 10 damage to all the bench Pokemon, all my bench Pokemon, tails is 10 damage to all his bench Pokemon. He does get that, so now I actually get nice things. But that's not gonna be enough yet to really save me, unfortunately. Oh, he did kill my chance. He did, did kill his chancy though. Come on, something good. A drowsy is not going to help me. Um, a magneton is also not going to help me. But I do have a computer search. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of two of these and start getting out the magneton. And that might be actually decent. Um, not the best thing in the world, really. I could definitely go with something better. But um, at this point, I don't really have much else, of, much other of a choice here. Uh, Cyburn's going to do a lot of damage, not enough where, e where a Magneton's going to be able to kill, though, so I'm going to need to do something clever here, I guess. He's not going to risk his own bench Pokemon this time. He's going to go for his other attack, which is a 3 damage paralysis attack. Going to kill off my Mewtwo. I am in a tricky situation here. Um, I'm going to hope I get the Psychic Energy. I'm going to try to spot out this Abra. And I did get the Psychic Energy, so that's good. Um... Because then Magneton can come in unscathed and do some damage. Uh, it doesn't matter if I lose this off here. Magneton is going to be my last hope, though. So it's, it's either Magneton or Bus at this point. Um, he's going to go for the Freeze Dry. Going to hurt me. 
but I will be able to revenge kill, and then hopefully Magneton's gonna need to kill off the rest of the this guy's Pokemon. Because I don't really have much else. He hasn't even played his his own legendary yet. Alakazam, you would have been so much helpful some other time. Alright, well I'm gonna get the Magneton out. Sonic Boom is going to kill. Uh, it's only gonna be doing 20 damage at a time though, and that's not gonna be doing too much, so. Um, I guess I could go for a Sonic Boom. Well, he's gonna go for Confusion now. Darn it. Cannot afford Confusion at the moment. Oh, here comes his, uh, his thing. Uh, heads I'm paralyzed, tails I'm not. Luckily I don't get that, so. That's why I think it's the worst one. He is gonna, he does like to return it though to his hand and then play it again to get for the more paralyzation. So that is the advantage. He has gotten Confusion every time! That just is stupid, game. Okay, well I have a Switch, so what I can do is... Um... I don't even know, really. I am trying to figure out the best way to do this. I really just need to not get hit by... I need to not get this confusion here. We can't have nice things. We cannot have nice things anymore. I'm getting killed by these Grandmasters. Alright, I am running really quickly out of options. I need something. Come on, some Miracle Mewtwo. Maybe... Not really gonna help that much, though. I can't, I'm not gonna be able to afford to switch in here, so... I'm going to... I need the Psychic Energy, that's the thing. Darn it. Um, well, I'm going to go ahead and just... I can't afford to do this, though, unfortunately. Damn it. Um, no, I'm not going to retreat. I'm going to go ahead and switch out and switch into this Drowsy and just... Hopefully it won't kill too fast. Okay, go ahead and paralyze this thing. I really don't care, dude. Um... That is going to suck. I need to hopefully use that Magneton for Prelice. I need I need to go for a draw at this point. That is only my really my only option. That thing is going to hurt a water gun really fast. Ay 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 ay. Um Hypno, save me. However, that's uh, I really uh, I'm out of options at this point. This is game over. So, he's going to paralyze paralyze size, a paralyze. Yes, that's a word. I cannot get a win off these guys here. He's, see, he likes to scoop up and do that. That's his basic strategy, is to use Confusion and Paralyzation and really be annoying of his deck. Uh, at this point, I'm pretty much out of options, so that is going to be the game. I just could not get any momentum going there with those Confusions. Just, why can't we have nice things? That is the moral of this story. Well, guys, I will have to meet you guys back here again for another episode, and we're going to have to fight Jack once more, so... I will meet you guys in just a bit in part two of this crazy fiasco. And now you're going to kick me out. You're a jerk, Rod. Alright, I'll see you guys in a bit.